Yeah, that was fun opening for you guys on that tour where uh, Archaic played with Alex Bent. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. So I saw that show, and I saw you play Nate, and that was my, my live memory of you. What was so. the lineup for that again? Severed, Archaic, Genocost, and then the California dates would have Ontogeny on them as well. It would have been cool if you were out there with us the whole time, dude, just being able to see that every night and being able to kick it and get yeah, well, blazed I, I all still night. Have a blast. You know, I, I feel like, so when Archaic was on, he mentioned that and he said, yeah, this tour is kind of beat. I was having fun because I was watching Severed Savior play and I was watching, you know, Alex Bent play and that was fun. And uh, I, I have fun playing shows because I have fun playing with my band live. So, so as cliche as it sounds, I enjoy playing. I've played shows with no one in there probably more often than I've played shows with people in there. So it, it's really, it. you have to find fun where you get it. And I really do have fun playing with my band in my room on a stage, wherever the case may be. I, I, I look at my band as I play and I have fun with them. So, uh, and I've I'm seen a- it many times, dude. And I can see that that's a true statement, you know? Yeah. I've I- seen that too. I've been to a couple of your shows where, um, it's not that many people there and you're still just fucking like headbanging. Like there's a 10,000 people in there. You know what I mean? Like you're giving it all you got and fucking, I've seen that a few times from you. Just like, it's you're acting like it's fun, fucking man. sold out fucking at Madison square garden, but there's, there's, there's 13 people there and we're just, you know, we got our arms crossed because we're all looking <laughs> at each other. Like, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Yeah. You gonna want to mosh? Or are you gonna mosh? You gonna, you... <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I'm that guy at shows too. To be honest, I'm the I'm the hands cross guy. Are you gonna mosh? But but uh, I guess for Meshuga, I'm Jack Daniels running to the pit guy. But, uh, <laughs> it, that shit's fun. I we played Texas when we were on tour with Soul Sunder, and there was literally no one in the audience. And I remember we're playing. I walked off stage and I started watching our band play, and I was like these guys are all right you know <laughs> that was the first time i ever got to see see my band play because there was no yeah. one there and i still had fun for that too so i that's I, funny in texas i did the same thing dude because I, I brought a wireless mic with me and there was only 15 20 25 max people at this place dude and i just said fuck it dude i'm going out into the crowd i did like four songs i pitted with everybody while i was fucking doing vocals and shit like yeah. what's up dudes i'm down here <laughs> That's you fun. just fucking have fun with it dude dude i remember seeing odious at that show and saying the singers have got sandals on bro <laughs> 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 yep dude that's me dude that's uh, fun. Like, i had a, I had a chicken uh fuck it must have been it was it was a southern state and she literally beeline to me after the show just to tell me like why the fuck are you wearing sandals dude and i'm like are you here to fucking look at my outfit you know are you here to listen to some music because i'm comfortable in sandals dude yeah 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 (laughs) it's probably better for you on tour too because you get some foot funkage if you don't oh yeah dude my shit's gotta air out dude oh man i can only imagine if you were those bands who like wear knee-high fucking spike boots Uh, and all this shit and makeup every night on tour oh i know oh, we yeah we toured if they with made uh, steel toast if they made steel toe sandals dude i'd wear them at work dude 